What's going on everyone? I'm Steven and today we are looking at another virtual battle but this time it's a halftime show battle between the blue and gold marching machine from North Carolina a t University and the, the Marching 100 from FAMU. The footage you're going to see in here is courtesy of Blue and Gold Marching Machine Media and The Marching 100. There will be links down in the description below to both of these performances as well as in the cards at the top. Be sure to go watch those original videos so you can see and hear them without any of my interruptions. If you hear this song at any time the little theme to this show here played over anyone's show. That means that the band's music was copyright claimed or a melody within a song. Something happened and we just dubbed over that. So go watch those original videos, like I said, to see them in their originality. <laughs> okay, the North Carolina show you're going to see is from their Aggie Eagle Classic and the Florida a m show you're going to see is from the game when they went against South Carolina State University. This is a producer request and the producer who requested this video is Mario, not Luigi. LOL, ha ha ha. And they would like for you to know this. I love both of these bands, but I wanted to know which halftime show is more entertaining to everyone. <laughs> I have no idea what you sound like. You can now become a producer for the channel and gain access to these special perks. Special behind the scenes photos and uncut videos of the show. Special shout outs and promotions for members, meaning that I could shout out your name or promote something that you want me to promote. I'll reply to all of your comments on videos first. And the big one. Producers will be the only ones able to request videos for me to react to and review. Yep, only producers requests will be made into videos. To become a producer, all you have to do is click the join button located right next to the subscribe button. <laughs> I have no idea what you sound like. Okay, so we're about to get into this video, but first, check this out. Look at this graph. Do you see that? It says that 70% of you all are not subscribed to the channel, but watch the videos anyway. So do me a favor, stop what you're doing right now and subscribe to the channel, like the video or dislike the video and comment and just share it with somebody. Go ahead, do that for me. All right, first up, it's North Carolina A&T University Blue and Gold Marching Machine. Let's check it out. Great job, media team, right off the rip. Just great job. I love the uniforms. The uniforms look very cool. Look like little superheroes out there. <laughs> Nice balance sound, very nice. All right, Melophones. Wow, look very good, ladies, look very good. Love the outfits, very nice. Again, great camera work, great, great, great camera work. I like the variation, the marching styles. I like how it can be like a low march, then like the high knee lift. And I love how the instruments stay facing forward when you guys move side to side. Look pretty good. Nice A and T formation. I appreciate how the media team puts the songs in the bottom of the videos for people like me. Look good, man. Very neat. Very neat. Yeah, I like that. I like that split screen. That's nice.
Sound clean too. Look clean, sound clean, very good. All right, drum major, look good. I love how the dancers are also the ones doing the flags. From everything that I'm seeing, everything looks very neat. Very good, ladies. It looks like the media team is having a lot of fun and they really appreciate what they're seeing and what they're showing. It feels like they cut the video together to go with the show. Very nice, very nice. Nice sound, Ben, very nice. Wow, all right. All right, so from the media team, tell me, are you all film majors or, you know, um, I guess, what are you, mass communication majors or whatever it is? Because you all have very good training. I'm talking about the media team. It's very well done, very, it feels like you all are planned and not just random spots, if that makes sense. It's a very nice shot right here. I'm keeping my mask on. Wow. And band, you all sound very nice. I have very, very little to say about the band. So I'm really just mesmerized how well the video is put together. Yeah. Nice dynamics. Because you know what's coming. Here it is. I see your flags and majorettes. Are these all the same ladies? Very impressive. I see your clarinets. Wow, that looks great. Look at those flags. Wow, wow, wow. Now they have brought out ribbons. Yeah, very nice. One thing I can say though, I could use about 50% more tuba sound to balance the whole band, I mean. Welcome back, T.I. Alright, drum majors. Very 
sparkly outfit. Yeah. knew the name of this song. Yeah, it'd be nice if everybody put the names of the song at the bottom of the screen. That, that helps me out a lot. I really appreciate that. Very exciting. Very exciting show. Very well put together. It seems like the band's very well rehearsed. I love how the ladies can do uh, everything. And the band, you sound good. Very nice sound. Yeah, nice shot right there. You can see the crowd. Nice sound. <laughs> All right, so that was North Carolina A&T performing their halftime show from their Aggie Eagle Classic, and I am I loved it. It was very nice. I love the camera work from the media team, how it was edited together, because we all know, for being marching band people, we know that you perform for those two audiences, the blind and the deaf. And, you know, let's say if I could not hear this band and I was able just to see this video, it was very well put together in the way it was edited together with all the cuts and stuff like that. And I think that really boosted up the excitement, especially for the dance routines, because we've all seen dance routines from that one angle. And they can be very, very nice, very good. But when the camera plays a part in the show, you know, it's giving the viewer that perspective that they don't see. And, you know, it's, it's just very nice, very well put together, very nice shots. Every shot looked very great. Uh, All right, let's get into these scores. Here's how the team and I have decided to update the field show scores moving forward. There will be 10 categories, all worth five points each. The highest you can get is 50. The categories are drill music, which is basically the music that the band played during the drill. Feature music, which is the music that is played during a feature. The feature could be a dance feature, it could be a ballad, or it could be a percussion feature. That's all in that same category. Uniforms, how did the entire band look from head to toe? Uniforms. Drill and design. What kind of show was it? Was it neat? Did it look good? Was it fun? Did we have some good pictures? Were they identifiable? Drill difficulty. If the band comes on the field and just stands in a box, this would be a low score. What did the show consist of? How difficult was the step two drill? Were there animations? Were there pictures? Stuff like that. Anything but just the box. Marching technique. How did the band look when they moved? How was the knee lift? The horn swing? Snap and drive. Drum majors. How did they look? Flags and auxiliary. If there are no flags and auxiliary, the drum major will also score in this as well. Auxiliary also includes props. Dancers. This category is for the dance team, but if a band does not have a dance team, the flag auxiliary unit will also get a score in this section. And finally, dance routine. Was the dance routine good? Was it hype? Did you enjoy it? Did you have fun? Was the energy high? And the rating system is as follows. 41 to 50 is superior. 31 to 40 is excellent. 21 to 30 is good. 11 to 20 is fair. 1 to 10 is poor. And zero is absolute trash. And the program is a danger to society and needs to be shut down. Immediately. For drill music, I'm gonna give that one a five. Everything that I heard sounded great. I loved the way that the music was all balanced and I did hear dynamics. So everything when the band was moving sounded very clear. Great job. For feature music, same thing. I'm gonna give that a five. For feature music, it's a five. Everything that I heard is just like the drill music. It sounded clear. I heard dynamics. I heard articulation. It was very well balanced. And this was for both the dance feature song and the slow ballad song that showcased all the flags and the ribbons and stuff. Great job. For uniform, it's a five. I love the way that band looked from head to toe. I like the color combinations. I like the everything. Look great. I didn't see no one's hats flying off. No, it looked like everyone had on spats, you know, the usual stuff, gloves and whatnot. So great job. And the ladies, 
awesome outfit. It was I didn't know it was that sparkling to get that close-up shot at the end. So great job, everybody, with the uniforms. It's a five. For drill and design, it's a five. All the lines were nice and straight. The formations was clear and I understood what was going on. I could tell that they did a lot of intricate stuff and the band were moving positions so you can hear the songs and hear how that, I bet it sounded, if you were there, I bet it sounded really great in person. But everything was cool and I love how they moved the same way they played. Like sometimes they had like a, a low march, you know, like kind of like a little walking type style. And then some of them were going slow, some were going fast. But when they were marching, all their knees looked good. So for drill design, I'm gonna give that a five. For drill difficulty, I'm gonna give it a three. Everything I saw was pretty simple. You know, the show was pretty straightforward. There weren't any animations, no big things that require any type of props and everything like that. It was just kind of like, oh, okay, wow. But the magic of the show to me was the way it sounded and the auxiliary unit, the dancers, the flags, and all of them. So for difficulty on the drill, it's a three. For marching technique, it's a five. I love how North Carolina a and can switch from a high knee lift to like a core looking style. What is that? We're gonna just call that like a low knee lift or walk? What is that called? But anyway, I love how it can switch from back and forth. I like how when the band, you know, moves, when they like move left or right, they stay facing forward. I just thought, I just think that's nice and that's cool. So all the sound can stay forward. So for March Technique, it's a five. Drum majors, it's a five. I love the uniforms. I love how you guys look. You guys like you were performing to the cameras or you know, not necessarily to the camera, but you knew the camera was there. So the performance from both of you all was great. And you all looked even. When I say even, look the same on this side and on that side. So every time I saw you all, you guys look great. So great job, drum majors. For flags and auxiliary, it's a five. Baton twirling, ribbons, flags, everything look pretty. I love the contrasting colors and it's a great visual for when the band is standing still or even when it's in motion. It's, it's fantastic, so it's a five. For the dancers, two things. Number one, every time I saw a shot of you all, everyone looked the same and like you all were performing, not just for the audience, but also for the cameras. And number two, the cameras itself set everything off. It was like watching a music video. Not taking away nothing from anyone else's media team, but this is a great example of how cameras can play a part into what's going on. Because there were certain moves that happened and the camera knew what was going on. It's like the media team went to practice, which I know that, you know, some of them do, but when I train media teams at schools, you gotta be a practice. Because it's amazing when you can have your media team in the show and you can't even see them. That is cool. And imagine the kind of shots you can get and stuff like that. So again, with the dancers, when they did like some moves, they were like doing a flip or something, it'll cut to a camera that's actually tracking with them. And then it'll like actually do like this nice power zoom into like a cool rack focus. It was nice. So the whole performance with the, with the ladies dancing was really well. So those are the two reasons why the ladies get a five. For the dance routine, it's a four. I really enjoyed the way the camera work was for the dance routine. Again, they knew what was going on and they were able to edit the video in a way where it looked like it was a fun music video. So like it'll cut to the people right when they're doing something, all the shots were pretty much clear. And even when they did like a rack focus, it was intentional. And that to me is what made the dance routine a lot more exciting than what I actually thought it was if it was just like from one camera angle. And of course the band sounded great, so it's a four. And that brings the total score to 47 out of 50. And that's definitely a superior score. Great job, blue and gold marching machine. Up next is the Marching 100 from Florida a University. Let's check them out. And this is the halftime show they performed at the South Carolina State University game. Ladies and gentlemen, we can now be seated. The performance is about to begin. I love their announcer, it's like a movie. <laughs> the performance is about to begin. <laughs> All right, March 100. All right, flags. You think I did flags in a former life? Nice sound, fam. You nice sound. Can't wait when the band is a lot bigger, though. It sounds better when it's bigger.
Let the drone shot. Strike. Look good, drum majors. Nice dark sound. Nice camera work media team. Let the people see the instruments that are playing the music. Kiss me. For a second, I was like, what the? F <laughs> very nice, very nice. I really appreciate the drone going up there in the top because we all know that um, FAMU Stadium is not necessarily high enough so you can really, you know, appreciate the formations they do. So that's a nice touch. That looks really good. Oh, we got a camera on one side and one side. Okay. Nice. All right, trombones. Flags, you can make it, you can make it flags. I mean, shoot, y'all been fast march for like two minutes now. I appreciate all the pageantry, but like, you know, fast march, like, get there and move on. The director hero shot. From the west side of the center, far and far, you can sing along the word love. That in the band world, that in the band world is what we call the hero shot. That's the shot where the band director is on the podium with a ladder conducting. You can see the people behind him. I hear trombones, lower breasts. Nice sound, nice sound. Shout out to the media team here. Great job with those nice close-ups. When the band's not moving, it's really nice to show the close-ups of the instruments that are playing. Yeah, like that. That looks really, really good. Great sound, too. Great sound. I see your flags. It's gonna be nice when that flag court get up to like 30 people. Like next year, watch. Those very pretty drums.
very nice, very nice. Media team, band, everyone, very nice. <laughs> oh man. I'm sorry, I'm laughing at it. <laughs> it looked like this one flag person just took off running for his life. It just looked very funny. You know, just looked up and he was like, It's like a fight scene, wasn't it? Get that horn up. Nice, very nice. Tuba players trying to outmark each other right here in the front. All right, so there you have it. That was the March 100 for the halftime show against North Carolina a and for this virtual battle. But that was actually the halftime show when they went against South Carolina State. So let's check out these scores. Okay, for drill music and for feature music, we're gonna give those both a five because they sounded great. And I heard dynamics, balance, and contrast from all of it. So for the first two categories, five for both of them. For uniforms, it's a five. The band looked great, and I love how the camera did showcase the band on those close ups. It was really nice. You can see the detail, the uniforms, the instruments, all that stuff. So great job. That's a five. For drill and design, that's a five. Everything I saw, especially with those drone shots, all the lines look straight. You could tell what the formations were, and it was fun to watch. So I'm gonna give that a five for drill and design. For drill difficulty, it's a four. The band made some words, made some pictures, and a lot of cool stuff was going on. It felt like the show was constantly moving forward with the amount of different pictures the band put on the field. So for that reason, it's a four. For marching technique, it's a five. The band always looked great. I even saw two was at the very end on the sidelines given 90s like they was going back and forth with each other which is always fun because we all know how it is we had like that good band buddy to compete against it makes both parties better so great job band and everyone else i saw looked great from all the marching the horn swing good job family always does a great job with that so it's a five for drum majors it's a five they always look good to me i like that style a lot and i do believe that the drum majors do enhance the show when they go to their little spots in the formation because sometimes they do that little <laughs> that's what i call it that little cape thing whenever they just like look i'm holding 
holding my cape out in the front. Now I'm holding my cape out this way and it's like a cool flash type of move. That sounds so silly when I say that. But every time it does happen, it's like it kind of makes my eyes go like this. Oh, cool. There they are. Oh, there they are. And it's not like, you know, hey, look at me. I'm over here. I'm over here. No, it's, it always kind of fits with what's going on. So great job, drum majors. For flags and auxiliary, it was just the flag core and I thought they looked great. Again, I really love the camera work from the media team, like showcasing all the things that was happening. That's a great marketing technique for recruiting. Just FYI for everybody else, show the instruments that you want to recruit, show them. So with that, it's a five, great job flags. Fam, you doesn't have any dancers, but this score does filter down from the flag, so to get a five again, so great job. And for the dance routine, it's a four. I had a lot of fun, the camera work did a great job, and I don't really know exactly what would be a five when it comes to a dance routine. I'm thinking it's gonna have to be something super, super big. But for the most part, it's a four, great job. And this brings a total score to 48 out of 50, and that's obviously a superior rating. Great job. The Marching 100. From Florida A&M University. Okay, so there you have it. Here are the two scores. North Carolina A&T gets a 47 out of 50, and Florida A&M gets a 48. Just a one point difference. But the producer who requested this video would like to know what you all think. So comment down below, which show was your favorite? Did you have one? Were both shows entertaining? I believe the question was, which show is more entertaining to you? So if you care to put in your information, please let us know down in the comments. Do you agree with the scores that I gave? Or do you not? Let me know. Comment down below. Peace. Thanks for watching this video. I really appreciate it. If you'd like to make a request, consider becoming a producer. You can do that by clicking the join button located right next to the subscribe button. And if you like this video, hit that like button and be sure to leave a comment. And if you want to see more videos just like this, there are hundreds on this page and be sure to subscribe to the channel for new content.